You know, it's almost time to start training for the Bellens Women's Half Marathon. Free sessions begin July 10th. And race spokeswoman Kelly McBride Moore is here to share in the excitement along with tips for prepping for this year's events coming up on Saturday, October 5th. So, yeah, if you backtrack time, it's right. We got to start training. It's time to start <laughs> training. So, we're going to start our free choice weekly training okay. runs. Um, there will be Wednesdays and Saturdays, 6 a.m. Bell and Health Title Town. Those start on July 10th, so right after the holiday, people can kind of yeah. get geared up for that, those training sessions. All levels and abilities are welcome, so I think that's a fear sometimes uh -huh. people have. It's, it's yeah. everybody from really even your walker to your mid pack to um, your faster runners. If you come, you're going to have somebody to run with. Sure. We know how busy our participants are, especially in the summer, so that's why we want to offer those twice weekly. Training runs. We mm -hmm. start at three miles, we build up to 11 miles, oh. and we build in those mileage cutback weeks um, so we, people can kind of maximize and optimize that training sure. plan. 11 miles. <laughs> oh, <I'm> just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I understand that com camaraderie is a big, uh, big event of these training events, right? Just, Absolutely. You know. It's a huge component. So a lot of yeah. women will come with their training partner, their relay partner. Mm -hmm. but a lot of women will actually meet that training partner. At the event, or somebody that they can run with, talk with. You know, you're out there for for a while, sure. as, yeah. as you mentioned, especially in some of those later runs. But there's a real sense of camaraderie and sisterhood, which is a big aspect of our event as well. So there's just a real sense of togetherness. There's also that accountability piece. You're a lot less yeah. likely to hit snooze sure. if you know that that training partner or training group is out there waiting for you. All right, and if your participants are experiencing aches and pains and things like that, there's uh, an additional on site resource for that. Yes, so our Bellin Health Title Town Walk In uh, Sports mm -hmm. Injury Clinic. Um, is a terrific resource for our participants, um, as well as anybody really in the community. It's free. You don't have to be a Bell and patient to be seen. Um, as I said, it is walk-in, so no appointment is necessary. And um, that is an uh, opportunity to be evaluated by a licensed athletic trainer, and that individual will help you determine uh, treatment options. Sometimes it's just rest, ice, elevate, take a few days off. Sometimes you might need a, a higher level of care, and they can direct you into that pipeline of care as needed. And that's open six days a week, starting at eight o'clock. So especially after some of these longer runs, yeah. uh, you, you <laughs> go put, direct. To exactly, not, past go. not, not past go. Town. Absolutely. <laughs> so that's another great resource. We also offer runners assessments, um, uh, complimentary, supplementary classes, and other things for our participants. And, and again, for anybody who might be interested in that as well. You know, we're talking about training and everything in this two-person relay, but there's also a training program for the Bell and Women's Pink Pumpkin 5K. Yes. Okay, let's talk about that. That's yes. more up your alley. Is yeah, that what you're yeah, yeah, 5K, <laughs> Absolutely, like the 5K that. distance. <laughs> so, this is our second year partnering with the Breast Cancer Family Foundation yeah. for the Bell and Women's Pink Pumpkin 5K. We didn't have a specific training program for that last year, and that was, I think, a, a gap for us. And oh. so, something that we're looking to to implement this year. We are really excited to be partnering with the YWCA of Greater Green Bay for that. Um, we aren't quite ready to announce those details, but that will begin sometime in August. And that'll probably be targeted uh, a little bit more toward that first time runner, somebody mm -hmm. who might need a little bit more support as they build up their mileage uh, to run or walk that ping pumpkin. 5K on race day, October 5th. Yeah, I don't care if it's one mile. You should do some training, right? Yeah, Absolutely. Right. You right. should be prepared. It's a confidence <laughs> thing, and it's a lot of fun. Exactly. All right, thanks, Kelly. Those free training sessions begin July 10th. Again, Wednesdays and Saturday mornings at 6. Just head over to Bell & Health Title Town, right there across from Lambeau Field. And to register for the races, head to bellandwomenshalf.com. You'll want to do it now. Those prices go up July 1st. Here's